Hey, this is Linda and Kathy here today. We're going to do a cake video. And my friend Caroline Davis, she does, she's a Mississippi queen and she does cooking videos in her home. She sent me these two beautiful cookbooks to look at and gave them to me. And I'm going to make a cake out of hers today. Now. So today I'm going to do her peanut butter poke cake. Okay, let's get close up there just in case. Somebody misses any of our ingredients. The first thing we're gonna do, I'm gonna preheat the oven to 350. You take a box of cake mix, chocolate cake mix. I got Pillsbury. You Is it like use, devil's food or just chocolate? Devil's food. I got the devil's food. Chocolate. You can use whatever you prefer. Right. You put your box of cake mix in here. We put a half a cup of canola oil, a cup of water. Three eggs. Or if I did that, I have eggshells everywhere. <laughs> yeah, you just gotta get used to it. You just go with the baking instructions on here and you beat it for two minutes, and then you pour it in your pan and we'll bake it at 350 for 34 to 35, 38 minutes. Usually 30 does mine, but just check your oven. Sure, yeah, and it. check your directions on your box. Yeah, on your box. And it'll so tell you. It up right mm -hmm. now. Put it in your pan. So we'll put it in the oven and bake it and be back later. Now, we're going to set our cake over here. And Caroline said in her book, while it's still hot, take... Okay, fork or straw. Mm -hmm. Or a spoon, whatever you want to use to make holes in it. So, poke cake. Like poke cake. It's like called a poke peanut butter cake. Yeah. Next thing we do, we take a cup and a half. Peanut butter. <laughs> Put this bowl right here. Pour condensed milk in down with our peanut butter. Put two tablespoons of milk. Mm -hmm. And then just mix all this together. But if you need more, you can add a little more milk because she wants. She said it needs to be loose when you pour it over. Okay. Top. Spread over it while it's getting hot. <laughs> We're gonna set this in the fridge for an hour and a half, and then we'll finish it up. Okay. We're back with her cake here. Next step. We'll spread it full of Cool Whip. Boy, it looks good. Yes, it does. We spread our whole thing of Cool Whip on this thing. Oh, that looks so good. Mm -hmm. right. <laughs> Crunched up Reese's Cups all over it here. Next. Just go down through here. Wow. And then we'll go down through here. Hey, this is our cake for today. Yes, and I want to thank Caroline for sending me the books. I'll be using a lot of them, I'm sure, to picking out them. They're really good, and I appreciate it. Y'all have a great day. Thank you. Have a good one, guys. Bye.